Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna talk about what to wear in awkward situations and hopefully it'll be helpful. It'll be a mix of Matt wearing stuff and me wearing stuff because hopefully our advice isn't gender specific. Before we get started, thank you so much to the three or four people who subscribed recently, Juan Pablo and Jack, Yandi and Dominic. We love you guys, thank you. So we'll get started. One outfit idea is for when you get invited to the Yankee Stadium and the only thing I I would suggest that you don't wear any Yankees gear and you should be fine. If you are going to Midtown for an interview and you fail your final round at an MBB consulting firm or some other huge interview that you've been studying for for months, put something really fun into your outfit that you can enjoy right after the interview and help you relax and take your mind off of it. Maybe wear a fun t-shirt inside of your button down that you could wear around the house afterwards. I this outfit idea with a tank top inside and so I can just take my blazer put it in my bag after the interview and just go out with friends have a good time and relax maybe you want to do something different and write some words in your belt loop that say that you don't really care what happens and I have white socks in this because I really don't care I'm not gonna be afraid also I, I recommend having a phone case when you go there was this crazy time when I walked away from an interview and then right afterwards I just dropped my phone on the ground and it cracked so learn from my mistakes whatever it is that makes you relax and makes you feel like yourself is probably good this one is if you break up with someone before you consider your clothes, I think the biggest thing is to consider where you're going to do it. And if you have any control over that situation and where it's going to be, I would recommend picking a really small park and doing all of your breakups there because then all of your bad memories can be geographically contained into one small area. That'll be your breakup park. And if you can, get something big or powerful to wear. It doesn't have to be a big jacket like I chose. It could be big earrings or a big hat or a big coat or big pants. Whatever it is that makes you feel powerful and independent is probably good. I also recommend having comfy shoes so you can walk away quickly, have dinner plans so that you have an excuse to go, and if you can wear a comfy big t-shirt that would be good because especially if it's really soft you can just be half changed into your pajamas by the time you get home and just relax. The only other thing maybe for all of these crazy situations that aren't that fun you could make your bed before you leave your house so that you have something nice to get back to the next one is if you have to go to a wedding but all your friends are getting married i think i still don't really like going to weddings so i just wear black because then there's no pressure to be happy <laughs> it seems to work because then you kind of don't have this pressure to agree with every emotion that's happening that day and there's some really beautiful wonderful moments in a wedding but you don't have to feel that happy or that excited to be there if you're just having a totally normal day and you happen to be at a wedding probably any dark color will do in the situation if you just don't want any pressure to be happy and then you can probably use that outfit for something else too you could also bring a phone or two charge phones and if you get bored you could just read the internet the last one is finding out that your rent increased <laughs> It's a hard time and things are getting really expensive and Matt here is wearing his Yukon slides and they bring him joy because the Yukon men's team won the championship again for the second time in a row just like the Gators did and so if we have to pay more rent then at least something good happened this year and that's it hopefully it was helpful to you I think next time we're gonna have more of a sports themed video coming up so stay tuned for that hopefully you'll feel like you're actually hanging out with us in real life and you're actually at our house and we're just chatting about whatever you want to talk about thanks for watching and see you soon